So finally, after what felt like ages, we got another update for Warframe. A story update, nonetheless. Prepare wisely. Loadout X will be limited. Uh, contain sequence of violence, fighting situations involving teens. It is intended for major audiences. Oh, this is sick. Love to Greg, Greg Hatha. Eat alive? Oh, what if food is bomb? That's genius, Cal. Just a grenade? You need more than a grenade, Cal. Oh my god. <laughs> Goodbye, Carl. We only knew each other for like... For the... 15 minutes. For my brothers. Yes, that's right. Farewell and a good journey. No. It was just my coffee mug, man. Oh. Don't be afraid. <laughs> Look at the back of his head. He has a small, tiny, smiley face over there. Hello. I need to break fire control from the fleet. Can you fix that, Vico? It's Vico, sir. What's your plan, Tiso? Well done, Vico. I hate you. Stand down. All stations. You'll be pleased to know that I, Alan V, have negotiated a peaceful and profitable transfer of power to our new fleet control. Firing sync re-engaged. Authorization, Corpus Tech First Class Viso Dash R. Take your shot for profit. That means LLV is dead too. Oh, that's me! Oh shit. My railjack is here. Do you think there's a shred of Lotus left in the tar? All this time, it's been dying. The two scorched from its rotting hole. Shut up! We will get Space Mom back. Okay, let's go. Where's the slingshot? I'll be awaiting your signal. Is that the slingshot? No. Ah, shit! I don't know where the slingshot is. Uh. Uh. I know. Shut up, guys! You're repeating yourself over and over. Is this the slingshot? No. I'm getting crazy here, boys. So, it turns out I'm a big idiot, uh, because my ship just ki kept getting destroyed. Um, and that's why it faded to black all the time. Uh, and this fade to black was a reload of a previous checkpoint. And that's why they kept repeating themselves.
Oh no, I hate sentience. I always did. From a gameplay perspective, because this bullshit elemental stuff. You're going to want to see this. Watch the veil do its work. Call out, Dax. I'm so Tessian, by the way. Come on, hit me, bitch. Summon your devil. It's time. <laughs> One for the reject pile, then. Hey, we are here, baby. And that's my mother, bitch. Oh, she is fucked up. What happened to her? Did I miss something? I watched the story refresher uh, just to play this update. But they didn't mention that she is all correct. You're going to die. You cannot kill the devil, Tenno. What you can send it back to hell? So after this glorious intro to this mission, um, Dallas won, we time skip a little bit, and he kind of brainwashed the whole galaxy, and yeah, we try to conquer it back, I think. Oh, as one. Yeah, that's right. It was the trailer with the with the gr all grown up Tenno, not children anymore. I like how they hit you with all this cinematic bullshit, uh, with explosions everywhere and fucking killing thousands of sentients, and then you go back into this stealth mission, I guess. Huh? Must have been the wind. Bye, bitch. Okay. Yo, this pistol is overpowered as balls. Oh, hi. I'm clenching. I can see what you're looking at. Hiya. No. Yes. So this is the new Warframe, huh? I'm a fucking scavenger, which would be a twist nobody would have seen coming. What do I think? We don't know what we're dealing with. No, we don't. But you know someone that does. So I grew some hair, fixed my makeup, 
we look much better now. So we proceeded to Solaris to free Little Duck and get a corpus ship to get us to Hanhao, uh, which is the father of Era and the Lotus or Natar. And he tells us we can only defeat, uh, we can only nurture Natar back to life uh, with the crystals from the Archons, which are these motherfuckers. And to do so, he gives us a sentient bow called Nar Naratuk. Naratuk. What? What? Wait. Let me. Let me check this. Uh. Wait. Wait. There it is. Nataruk. And with this bow, we kill a few bosses and nurture our mother back to health. Quiet down, please. Stand for pledges! By the glory and wisdom of the seven, I give my life. Hey, my Patrick! I've never had Patrick. an enthusiastic group of students. I think the teacher's hot. Eyes Do on you? The main screen and close attention. Question one. Which of the following is not one of the theories of time? Presentism. Futurism. Eternalism. Uh, futurism. Correct. Nice. Question two. What is the principal failing of presentism? Correct. As the name implies, presentism considers only the present to be real. Lynn Thomas' parents have been captured, but she has a choice. The button that will open her mother's cell door will flood her father's cell with deadly radiation, and vice versa. She presses one of the buttons. Under eternalism, which of the following statements is universally true? Eternalism. Correct. Versions of reality now exist in which each parent dies. Lintana is assigned to one of them, but the other is no less real and is theoretically accessible. Students, please direct your attention to the windows. You may find this instructive. In ten, nine, oh, this is the jump where the, where the mothership of the, of the Orokin crashed into the void. Why are we even saving her? I mean, wasn't she the reason why everything went to shit in the first place? Look at that face, man. So here's the deal. This ship was uh, hyper jumping somewhere. I don't know where yet. And uh, it had a bunch of kids and parents on there. And then we stranded in the void. After the jump we just saw on the, in the uh, school scene. Uh, and we ended up in the void and the children, so we uh, became the Tenno later. And we gained these void powers here in the void. But our parents got crazy instead and started to killing each other and try to kill us. Like Nicolas Cage and Mom and Dad. That's a reference. Yes. Hey, lose your light. Here, you can take mine. Thanks, kiddo. I think I will. Who are you? I'm... well, I'm not... I'm Tenno! Zeraman? All that? Ten? No. Time's up, kiddo. I can save them. All of them. But you have to want it. Let's say we shake on it. Don't we have a secret handshake or something? Make gang signs. Come on.
So we are seeing many possible futures here. And I am the only one that survives. That's why she's calling me kiddo. Because I'm her child. That's big brain time here, boys. I don't know what I am. But I know what I must do. Whoa. That was epic. And now I have to age again. Tenno. Even hell was not hot enough to split them. Then what is your command? Gather the fleet. She is coming to us. What's left of her? She will kneel before me. And, by my word, slaughter the only thing she has ever loved. And then, we feast. Yo, Digital Extreme really knows how to build ambience, man. They should maybe try their hands on a different game. Not that the Warframe isn't a good game, but maybe they should try. Around? Okay, so what is this, then? Are you from the... <laughs> future? Nah. But, that'd be a lot easier to get now, wouldn't it? As far as I can make out... You're the me that got rescued from this shit, and I'm the you that did not. Not sure which of us got it worse. The way this works seems like finishing this is either you, you, or me, you. So, what do we think? Oh, they let you decide on which one you want to play. Looks like I'm your operator for now. She's going to jack one of their murexes. I pity anyone who stands in her way. In her current condition... Malice will get inside her head, just like he always has. And will rip out her nervous system by the roots. We gotta stop her. So Plakasa was the original ship that the Orokin sent out into deep space and then just forgot about it, right? And it rebuilt itself over and over again, or made itself bigger, and spit out all these sentient assholes. Oh. This was fast. The sun. The sun, I see. That needs to be stopped. Yes, baby. Give it to me. Thank you. 
Kneel! Kneel, and I will spare these worlds. Beg, and I will make you complete again. I had something different in mind. You dreamed of a Margulis you could control, but she chose death over you. Beam. Make him shoot his mirror. Finally, she's back. After only five years. Six years? I don't know when she went missing. Let's get grinding, boys! <laughs> 